Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Wildfire Gaming, the greatest channel in the whole wide world under 60 subscribers. This is your boy, Slow Burr. And I'm Tree Trunk Sean. And we just got out of an ethereal plane. Yes. Unfortunately, did, not, got run, out of prison. did not run into Cody Rhodes in there. Yeah. And, or a flying car. Nope. And we are going to check in with the rest of our crew here. Didn't we? We already talked to Zalbar. Yes. And, there's still uh, Candrus and HK to consider. But they got spoken to in the big scene. Yes. Yeah, but this is uh, different. Ah. Uh, I think this is. Yeah. If you're ready to talk, then yes. So am I. And. I can't hate you. I tried. <laughs> I you tried, huh? Wait, what? Are, who? Who are Tellos? To stay? I don't. I don't remember anything about Karth. Is he just? Were we? Were those things that were supposed to happen but didn't? Um. He mentioned it for sure. There was actually a side quest with Karth that I think we fucked up or something. <laughs> was where that? Where we were supposed oh, to run into his son. Um, oh. But he, <laughs> and, and like his son had like turned to the dark side and stuff and like. We uh, I'm sorry. We're supposed to fix that. And either that or kill him. Uh, and. <laughs> We didn't do that, but he has mentioned him. And Telos is the planet that he's from, and it got all bombed during uh, Malik's bombing run. Huh. So yeah. How the hell did we miss that? I didn't. <laughs> I remember that. <laughs> oh wait. So what about his son? And all? so that that his part son, we actually did that. No, his son was not going to be on Telos. <laughs> we weren't going to go to Telos. He just mentions that his planet got bombed. But his son was supposed to be on Korriban, where all those Sith were. Did we just kill him or something? We killed it. Oh we yeah, killed, we, we killed everyone. Yeah. <laughs> But whatever. Anyway, we there's no way we can go back there now. <laughs> Why should I care if you hate me? Okay. Maybe you should. I would hope that my standing by you would mean something to you. Maybe you just can't. I got the revenge I always wanted when Saul died, but it hasn't brought me the peace that I thought it would. You have a darkness inside you that must be revenge. It must be something. More to you as well. I see it. I know it's there. There's everything to Homestar. I hate you. Why I don't want any more revenge. You don't. Have to be rabbit. You can be so much more. Whatever so much more powerful. Yes. Whatever's happened up until this the Jedi gave us all sorts of chances. <laughs> Didn't everyone on Dantooine get killed? Like when they when they suck in your spaceship and you wake up in the cages, they're like, "By the way, we killed all the Jedi." Yeah, like that's they right. blow up yeah. Dantooine. Yeah, I totally can say that. Well, I hope I can say. Because we just immediately. Yeah, we just immediately sold them out. We're like, I'll tell you everything. And that's like, right. That's just a test. We already killed them. That's right. <laughs> it was like, whoops. Well, I'm sorry. <laughs> this looks like a real punk for no reason. Until he did. Oh, uh, yeah. I've been given a chance. There's my oh, yeah, that's language right. We came, we came and talked to him. called him a punk. Because uh, we, we have to wait to talk to him until after we kill his little uh, challenger here on this planet. Um, so you belong to Revenant originally. Statement. Yes, Master. Me shortly after you and your apprentice began your war to conquer the galaxy. I guess we did a good job. On an assassination mission into Mandalorian space, but I was damaged and unable to return to you. Hmm. Exclamation. I find this most distressing. I could certainly I could feel the exclamation there. It was very powerful in his tone. Uh, it's probably better worked out this way. I'm gonna be honest, I didn't even read the last sentence of his stuff. But observation. You may be right, Master. This way we are reunited. And neither of us has suffered permanent termination. Yes, only partial termination. Uh, do you know anything about the Star Forge? Answer. No, Master. You never did make me what a shame. Any of the Star Forge I guess we knew he would maybe blow us up with it. In many ways you are, Master. Yes. <laughs> you have much of the beloved cruelty. Yeah. Excellent. You seem to have forgotten much. <clears throat> in some ways you seem improved from the human I once knew. We've leveled up a lot. That's so true. why all the meatbag references? Yes, it's a very amusing answer. answer. It was you who programmed me thus, Master. Your pupil once asked me what I thought of him, and I informed him of his meatbag <laughs> He was unimpressed. But you found the reference humorous. You changed my programming so that I would continue to use the term. It drove your pupil to extreme lengths of frustration. Excellent. I love the thought of... You know, old Homestar being a smart ass and just screwing with Malik. And Malik was the original meatbag. <laughs> of course you do, Master. You did then as well. That's what we'll have to call him next time we see him. Yeah. Uh, uh I guess we can ask him about Malik. Yeah. Commentary. Your former <clears throat> is efficient and brutal, even 
You know, all that yelling we did to do the sound check before we started doing the video, I sort of graveled it a bit too much. All right. Uh, yep. <clears throat> okay, that's everybody on the ship. Cool. So who do you want to take with us on this little excursion? Obviously, we have to take Candorus, and then we'll pick somebody else. Uh, HK. Okay. We got some lovely ambient noise here around us. We got a train going by, and rain. Yes. Uh, let's see, because I haven't looked at these guys for a long time, so I bet we have... Yeah, that's better right there. Hmm. And that... I don't really care that much about that. Well, wait, 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 wait. Doesn't he use blaster pistols? Yeah, but he probably already has all those feats. Ah. Okay, uh, I thought yeah, maybe it totally would stack does. on top of it. No. Ah. What? what? I don't know. Uh, we'll go with the, the other thing. Wait, what the hell? Okay. Well, this might be pretty good. No, wait. Is that what he has equipped? Oh, God, it's worthless. Oh. <laughs> there, let's just do that. Um... What does this do? Computer, computer use, use plus four. Oh, one plus six. Plus security plus six. I guess we'll go with the computer use plus six. And then this is security plus four. We'll give them the security plus six. Well, actually, wait. Just give them more computer use. I don't think it's going to stack. Really? Yeah. Gah. Kotor uh, and not stacking this nonsense. What does this thing do? Oh, it slows them down. I think I'd rather him do damage. What's the other one? Stun ray. Okay, damage. I like stun ray. So let's give him this advanced flamethrower. Sounds great. Let's oh, that. yes. I'm pretty sure... That thing, we had another one of those, and I think it basically saved us at one point. Um, yeah, I think you're right. And then we got an energy shield, class two, just what he's got is fine. Wait, does, yeah. Okay. And he's just got a regular blast rifle. Uh, pretty sure we can. he can do better than that. Um, I would hope, because we, we have a lot of things here. This thing is right there is better. Um, These weapons are all kind of terrible. This oh, hey, not, that's, But that's, that's heavy good. weapons, and he doesn't have the... Of course. A thing for that. But, I don't know, it's so much better that it might just be worth it. Can he, let's see if he actually, where is that? Let's see if he can get those, well, it's impossible now. Wait, that's heavy weapons? Yeah, we can just give him the heavy weapon perks as he levels up. Cool. And then, let's look at uh, Candorus. I think we actually switched him up last time we played. Probably, but I don't trust the last time we played. Yeah. We weren't quite thinking on the same See, like, level. I'd rather him have some heavy armor because he, he's like the only person hit, we have that yeah. can. And we made him an actual one. tank now by the putting him in the... That's pretty good, but it seems like this one was... No, I like the Kalanords better. Uh, that one's not as good as Kalanords. I think it's electrical. And plus, Kalanords is cool. has more stuff going for him, so... Yeah. Like that. Uh, he's got this, that constitution. That's pretty good, right? Yeah. This is probably the best thing, unless we want him to be immune to poison. Uh, but we don't get poisoned very often. So he's got will and awareness. Let's see if we can... Neither of those seem very useful no, for him. not at all. Well, wait, everything what's else the, sucks. Wait, what's the breath? I, I saw the required it's proficiency, but... Uh, I mean, that's a lot more useful than this. He doesn't even have Yeah, but any... we never are in, with, are in poison. And even if we were, he, like, regenerates his health. Yeah. Does he have... Whoa. Does he have any force powers? Does he have anything no. that would be used with will? I don't know. But he, he, the awareness will allow him to see where mines pop up and stuff. Ah. Uh, this thing seems like the best. The Craft the Dire Sword. Unless the, no, Naga Sidow's Poison Blade is it's pretty cool. That's, uh, we got that in one of those Sith tombs. All right, we'll give him that. Season, we got a whole lot of stuff in the Sith tombs. Yeah, we man. did. So, yeah, that was a good thing we came back in here and man. messed with this stuff. Uh, so, Fortitude so, is probably the best thing for him right now. And then, is there a reason that he's only one handed? Uh, see if, oops, not that I'm aware of. Let's see if if he has the duelist perk, then yeah, which he, he doesn't. He does not. Okay, well, well let's give we can one. fix that later. Yeah, let's just give him another one uh, until we give him the duelist perk, or we can just give him the two-handed perk. That thing is really good. The Krath Dire Sword. I think that's what I'm gonna go with. Cool. Sweet. Now he's gonna swing him around. Oh nope, just stand there with him. Okay. After after we do all this business, uh, killing his enemy, we should. You remember that little extra planet this? that... Oh, hey. That yep, guy got that's... so confused. <laughs> it concerns Raider. the Dark Lord of the Sith. Oh, wow. Great. It concerns the Dark Lord of the Sith. I am the Dark Ooh, yeah. Lord of the Sith. Yes, human, I know. That is why I have approached you. And you know why. Listen to me, and all will be made clear. My name is Zyagrom. I am a... 
a businessman. I and my partner deal in rare items of extraordinary, extraordinary value and power. With the exchange? No, oh. we are not. We are independent operators, though often our transactions involve those who represent the exchange. Traditionally, we have always done business with the owner of the Evan Hawk, Davik King most recently, Ahira Arthur before him, Fori Haksa before her, but we were reluctant to approach you. You're kind of scary. Yes. You had no ties to the exchange, which was a problem. Even worse, you are a Jedi, not the sort of person we normally associate with. But then we noticed that you kept killing everyone and got a bit suspicious. Uh, so why are you approaching me now? <clears throat> Our well, reports of the Evan Hawk traveling to many different planets. We wanted to know what you were up to. At your last port, I placed a small tracking device on your ship. You Whoa! bastard! You're lucky we don't kill you right now. No, that's not out of the question. <laughs> What's up? The tracking device reported back to us that you had been captured by the Leviathan. Once we had that information, we began digging into our sources within the Sith fleet. Go on. You're up. Oh. <laughs> He's up. Oh. Yeah, yeah, very excited about this. Created quite a star on the Sith fleet. Of course, Malik tried to suppress the truth about your identity. There were more than a few summary executions. <laughs> but even if security footage is destroyed and witnesses silenced, some bits of information always slip through. Spend enough credits to gather the tiny pieces, and the puzzle becomes clear. We know what happened on the Leviathan. At least, we know enough. You are Darth Revan, and you are going to kill Malak for daring to claim dominion over the Sith. Yeah, you know me pretty well, I guess. Uh, how does this involve you? Yeah. Well, our partner and I deal in very rare and powerful items. Weapons, armor, things you could use in your battles against Malak and the Sith. Oh, let me see them. I don't carry these items with me, of course. They're with my partner. But they're yours if you've got the credits to buy them. We do want to make a profit on this, after all. Just go to the Dreshda Cantina in Korriban. There's a Rodian in there, Rodian, whatever, named Mika Doran. Tell Mika that Zyagrom sent you to look at the premium items. All right, I'll check it out next time on Korriban, where everyone is dead except this one person, yes, I guess. Yes, he's gonna be sitting on a dead rock. <laughs> Mika already knows to expect it. Like I said, just tell him you want to look at the premium items. I guess my work here is done. Goodbye, Revan. And once Malik is beaten, don't forget who helped you to victory. Yeah, Han Star didn't need any help. And then he just disappeared. Huh. That was interesting. Let's well, see if we... What's funny is before that guy started talking, I was going to say, uh, after we finish all this, remember that planet? Yeah, I know what uh, you're going to say. Yeah. Go s we have got so much stuff to sell. Well, we could sell some of it to this guy, probably. I forgot about this horrible abomination of a creature. Does he have... Uh, that's our credits? Yeah. I think uh, people that you sell to in this game, they don't have like a finite amount of money like modern games right. do. Well, let's sell those six clothing there. So that, I was that zoned out for a moment because there was a card that said something about uh, targeting system, and uh, I was reminded of... Well, I'm sure, I'm sure you'll appreciate this. Your favorite comedians, the Game Grumps. A joke they made multiple years ago in their Pokemon playthrough, they were noticing that Brock just doesn't use his eyes. He doesn't. And uh, he said... I think many have noticed that before them. Yes, but he was saying, I guess he's like trying to uh, find a, a heightened sense like Luke was. Uh, I'm turning off the targeting systems in my eyes. Where the hell's that hut? He's gone. Uh, I've never uh, seen that happen. The racing guy? Yeah. This guy's still here. Does it matter? Griff! Oh, this is just the wrong place. <laughs> That's the mission's brother, remember? Yeah, what was he wanting, though? Was he wanting to attack Glenn? Yeah, it's just a bullshit, I think. You're lucky we didn't just kill you, fella. I don't think we can. Well, you're lucky it wasn't an option to kill yeah, you, Yeah, fella. you're lucky this is a fallout, dude. <laughs> um, yeah, so I just went to the wrong building. I was, like, about to say, whoa. <laughs> that was crazy. So I don't. Go. Did I pass this one? I, I have that? no idea. Yeah. yeah, let's just randomly save. Okay. There's the hunting lodge. Yeah, we said I got to do it yet. Bow. 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 Okay. So we're gonna sell that prison thing to the hut. 
Okay. Now, then we'll go out in the desert and find that dude who uh -huh. foolishly, foolishly challenged Candor's to a battle. Yeah. I can't believe that would even happen. The thought of somebody challenging Homstar. Well, they didn't challenge Homstar. They challenged Candorus. But unfortunately for them, Candorus has a much more badass uh, sidekick than they do. Yes. Or I guess leader. I, yes. They do. Uh, yeah, I got this box for you. Oh, that's in the box. <laughs> Supposed to be here a month ago, huh? Well, it's probably a little later than that at this point. We've I'll just taken say quite the break. He didn't open it. 2,000 credits. Oh, well, we're get more than Persuade. that. Yeah. <laughs> Man, this was a planet of making a lot of money. I assume we're going to get yes. a fair bit of credits after we kill this guy and oh, all of his friends, too. They just, like, came in on a football play on that one. There was, yeah, like, just... no coming through. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Mission, that used to be Mission's job, but I don't think we've had Mission in our team for a Probably very Probably because she kept time. pissing us off standing in our way. Yeah. She made it onto a highlight reel multiple times for in the wayness. That's true. In the wayitude. All right, I don't think we had any, have any reason to go in there. And here we go. All right, all right. Like I said, I can't remember exactly where this dude is going to challenge Candrus is, but we'll just kind of wander around and see if we can find oh, him. It's you again. I'll just let you pass. Yeah, Boys you will. May need authorization in triplicate, but not me. Thank goodness. I bet you have no idea who that guy is. I don't remember any of this he was, Yeah, he, we had to get like a hunter's license and, and he had to let yeah, us out. Right. Yeah. This was a long time ago when we, did, when we were playing Tatooine. Yeah. Yeah. It was a long probably, time since we even posted Tatooine. I was about to say, probably over a year has passed since then. Oh, absolutely. No yeah. question about it. What madness. So, it's kind of yeah. wild to me knowing that we haven't even posted all the stuff we did almost exactly a year ago yeah. in May. It's been a, it has been a long ass time since we recorded any videos. You know, we graduated, and then like six months of time passed, and here we are. <laughs> yeah. Opportunities in the world just happen to line up. Man, that was a squad turn. That right was. There. They were that's all it. just. I said we were like, hey, let's go kill those guys. It's just like, <laughs> boom. Who? You're gonna kill who? Yeah. They are holy, holy warriors. warriors. Just go for some insanity. It's been awesome. I've used this ability. Yeah. Oh yeah. All right. This guy. Boom. Whoa. This guy. Uh, Kanger's got some moves. Yeah. This guy's wow. pretty good. We're that other shit. guy, he's yeah. just, he's having a rough time out there. Yeah. Oh, oh, those guys. I didn't know that you had gotten a double tap. Oh. Oh. No. oh. 50 experience. What the hell? What a hoser. There. Uh, there's actually a level cap in this game, so we will likely reach it before we finish anyway. Well, that's pretty cool. I mean, we we put a pretty solid whipping on oh, anybody. Oh yeah, look at across. that. Kendra's poisoned that guy. Oh. With that sword I gave him. Nice. And I'm he's, sure he's using Kendra's you... weapon. That's cool. Yes. Somebody's got to keep it with us. Very customized. I'm sure team. you mentioned that you gave him a poison sword, but somehow I forgot. So, yeah. Pleasant surprise. Okay, this is it. Excellent. <laughs> Squad turn. Squad stand. Yeah. Managed to come after all. This guy looks very basic. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. Candace doesn't even give him the respect to look at. Yeah. He's like, Man. when I turn around, you're going to be dead. <laughs> I had this friend once who uh, he was challenged <laughs> to a fight at school, and he just stood with his back to the guy and gave him like a, like a cross pose. He was very confident. He said he was watching the eyes of everybody. Unfortunately, nothing happened. It would have been a much more exciting story if there would have been a fight. There's this, uh, in uh, Twilight Princess, there's this move you can learn where you just stand there with your sword sheathed, and when they run at you, you can just go, oh, wow! And it's like instant oh, that's death. Badass. It's called that's the Mortal a, Wound. It's like a Roroni Kenshin it's attack. very badass, indeed. If you like Roroni Kenshin, uh, like, comment, and subscribe. Maybe I'll mention it sometime again, ever. So, uh, what's he talking about? Kill him. Talk much and do little. Oh man, I can't wait to just kill this man. Yeah, this guy's a very average size. Is he a Mandalorian? Is that why he's trashing humans? Maybe. Yeah, I guess. Candrus had to talk over the shoulder at him. Let's do it, Candrus. I think you can talk him out of this, but why the fuck would you do that? Yeah. This guy's gonna, he's going down. Wait, what the hell happened? Oh, I accidentally paused it. I'm not sure how to, oh. Huh. Okay, oh. there we go. Uh, alright, let's insanity these guys. I didn't mean to do it twice. Well, well it's doubly done now. 
Yeah. Fly, Hunk Look at that Star. guy. Fly. He's dead. Dang. I was really hoping. It's over. Wow. That guy. <laughs> what a fool. Hopeless. What a slaughter. <laughs> no chance. That's just what they've got. This is almost a waste of time. <laughs> we came all the way over here just to kill these fools. I guess we and didn't get money from that hut. Yeah. Yeah, what'd you think? We about? didn't even get much XP from them. Nothing. We got like 110 experience from this whole thing. From this whole slaughter. Hooray. And, and we, got, we got more than that from killing those stupid sand people. Yeah, what'd you think about that, pal? I think this has affected me in ways I, I didn't anticipate. Uh, Epic. I thought he was just going to walk off into the desert. That would have been pretty cool. It would have. Uh, but I guess he's just stuck. Like, he wants to walk out into the desert, but he just hit a force field a couple of times. Okay, let's see if we've given him... Whoa, he's... Did, we, did we loot that guy? Yeah. yeah. Okay. What are your thoughts now? This thing with Joggy... It's making me uh. run around in circles <laughs> incoherently. You remember five seconds ago when I told you to give me more time? All five I needed. seconds was not enough time. Oh, wow, we got a gun. Just He's just pissed oh. up at us here. <laughs> <laughs> Meat bag. What an antagonist. Meat bag. Meat bag. Oh, well. Working for Davik was like driving a spike inside of your head. <laughs> this is the most glitched out conversation ever. Yeah, we may want this to is save up, after this, this is up, one. This is up there with that woman who was going, Hey, guys. Hey, hey. hey where are you going? What is he looking at? There's his dead friend in the background. <laughs> this is awesome. Uh, whatever. Uh, that's the way it should be done. Whatever. I don't even know what he said. Yeah, whatever. That's how, that's how every one of his stories that he's ever told us has gone. He'll be talking about, like, the epic Mandalorian battles, and we just talk over him. Oh, man, this line didn't even... Oh, until you came along. But I never wanted to challenge you. Good never choice. Although you but, probably could have beat us back then, honestly. Just like all yeah. years ago. A wise uh, decision. Yeah, probably. <laughs> you probably would have beaten Likely? Me. No. Maybe you would have. Well, I'm sorry, Roger, babe. who you were back then. I can tell. You've changed. And maybe I have. <laughs> Whoa, ridiculous. that last one was intense. Like, you've changed. And maybe I have, too. It was all the same to me. But now... <laughs> the pistol weapon is still <laughs> continuing. And Homstar is sick of it. He's trying to move his head out of the way. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, regret in a Mandalorian is unbecoming. In a Mandalorian. I'm not even sure what that is anymore. The Mandalorian are gone, defeated by the Republic, and swept away by but haven't we seen? I mean, I guess he did. That guy was one. We yeah. just we just continued the uh, slaughter of yeah. your people. I shouldn't be getting like this. Not when so many other things are happening. But, but sometimes a man just needs a like good cry. Boo hoo! What it is? Bah! This is unbecoming a warrior. Bah. Let's get on with everything before I start getting sentimental or something. Is there something else you want to know? <laughs> Your what a ridiculous conversation. <laughs> HK is so insensitive. Oh, now he, I thought he was about to start swinging at Candrus. <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here. Uh, Candrus is still just glitching around. Yeah, let's save it real quick. Oh, yeah, that's right. And actually, let's just end the episode because we're over 25 minutes. Alright. So, from Wildfire Gaming, I'm Tree Trunk Sean. And this is Slow Bird. Thanks for watching. We hope you enjoy it, and we will catch you in the next one. I didn't ruin it that time, so. You're welcome.